And welcome back to Flexible Games, where we are playing Satisfactory. All right, the next step in this, we need AI limiters. And uh, a lot of recipes, well, not a lot, but I think there's three different things that use these. Four, actually. Four different things use these. And we're going to need a lot of them. Almost 400 a minute of AI limiters. And these are going to be complex because of just how much raw material these are going to take. So if we want to get this up and running, we're going to need to prototype this. Um, let's uh, give ourselves some space. Make sure the output. Oh, we could do a little bit better than that. Uh, let's go in another foundation like that. Two, three, four. Because if we look, uh, do, 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 AI limiter. AI limiters don't have an alternate. And each one of these is going to use 500 quick wire a minute, which is why I need them in groups of four, giving us 2,000 a minute of quick wire for each setup. And we need four of these setups. The copper sheets, however, are going to total 2,000 a minute. So we could do all of this with one, one basically 2,000 a minute belt of copper sheets. So let's give ourselves some space. Uh, you're, uh, maybe right about here. And one, two, three, four, five. Perfect. Okay, so let's plan on copper. Let's plan on copper sheets being at the top. Be a lot easier to manage just one belt over the top of these. Now, <clears throat> the other four are going to have to be on this side. Why are you not line? Why are you not lining up there, sir? Just keep it going back, 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 back. Oh, that's, yeah, that's way too much space. Um, oh, right about there, I think, is a good spot. Kind of screws up my numbers on the side, but I know I have enough material. Okay, so this side is also going to need its own belt of quick wire. Um, hmm. Now that I'm looking at this, we're going to need another one going over the top like that. So this will be copper sheets. And then this will be quick wire for one side. And this will be quick wire for the other side. So I just want to make sure I don't mess this up. So let's line up. Let's see, we want copper sheets, and then we want, ooh, this, this might be interesting, because I'm just thinking, if we do these four, off of that belt, that means that goes away. And then these four, because I can't put another one of these down here. Every time I try to do that, it interferes. It can't, it, you can't put belt in there for some reason. So this one goes there. And this is going to be a little harder to line up because of these. I don't have a, a bounding box to work from like that. So that ends the copper or that ends the quick wire for these two. Copper sheets can go all the way through. So we're going to want, let's see, a merger. Oh man, we have another auto. 
auto save coming in. Good lord. Again, five minutes in, we hit an auto save. I can never time that right. Do 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 do. They're getting, they're just about getting long enough where I'm going to need to, like, cut these out. Um, okay. Uh, let's try. These. Unpack copper sheets. 65%. Okay. I should be able to squeeze in one on this side, one on that side. We're going to want a splitter. Doesn't need to be fast. Now, unfortunately, this is right in the middle of a seam here. So what we're going to do, that's copper sheets up there. What we're going to do... So we're going to split this over on the side here. Yeah, right in here. And we don't need some we don't need anything super fast, but just wanted to make sure that was enough space. Oh, look at that. Perfect. Uh, all right. Now power pole you go to that, you go to that, and you go to there, you go to there, and I know there's a power pole right in the middle of that, but we're also going to need quick wire. So we are going to want a quick wire setup here and here. Here, here. Merger. There. There. Splitter there. I'm not sure where quick wire is going to come up yet, but I know where it needs to be. So this, let's see, unpack quick wire. Look at that, right up, right up top. 65, 65. Quick wire is used in quite a few places, so it's, I don't know how I'm going to route this. But we need this to go up a ways. Uh, one, two, three, four. Get rid of that stub. You can go in like that. Okay. Now, we can have one of these go up just none, and then one go up two notches like that. And do I care? Since these are both lined up pretty accurately. Let's get rid of you and you. And you can go there. You can go over to there. You go into there. And you go into there. All right. So that takes care of these banks. This is half the amount that I need. Um, Oh, what did I... Oh, those should not be right next to one another. Those need to be spaced out. Derp. Um, that throws all of my values off here. Um, so what we're going to have to do... 
unfortunately. This go merger. Our packing machine here and here. Like that. Yeah. That sucks. I should have spaced those out. Or I could do a splitter like right here. And just like, ooh, let's be clean about it. Like that. Just another way of doing it, I guess. Um, power pole. that power pole. Come on, give it, give it. There it is. Ta-da! And then this one I'm going to have to redo again. No, why are you outputting... They were oriented right the first time. Wick wire. Okay, and then power pole here. that side which means the splitter goes right here like so and quick wire will probably have to go above here that is my guess I mean that'd be the the most obvious solution for that so, can we bring quick wire up right about here? There it is right there. <clears throat> That's the quick wire I need to bring in. So, hmm. can we figure out a way to do that? Uh, first, Okay, these are these are filling up good 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 I don't have any of these set up yet why are those not powered oh I bet you the recipes aren't set AI limiter AI limiter okay so the next batch is gonna have to be over here and we need two more unpackers. Um, where are these basically aligned? Well, basically one notch in, okay. So we're gonna give ourselves some space. We don't need to be cramped in one, one there and there. No. And then a splitter. Right in there. there 
So the quick wire supply is going to come in there. I'm going to loop that around and it's going to go into here. Now for the rest of these, uh, these are rotated wrong. So let's get those right. Let's get the edge of that foundation. Give ourselves a little wiggle room there. Two, three, four. This should all line up. Okay. my line. Beautiful. So these I can power across. And then this can power that one, this can power that one. Okay. Quick wire. And then each one of these. Get rid of their red, that'll tell me if I miss any. Yellow, 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 all those are yellow. Both of those are yellow. As is all of these. Excellent. So the output for these, we can put in mergers, <clears throat> and I want to have these come. Supercomputers are going to use them. Crystal oscillators are going to use them. Um, and the turbo motors themselves are going to use them. So I don't really have to bring them back this way. I can. Kind of a tight fit there, but I need. need that space. Hmm. We're going to go this way with that. This one I'm going to bring out this way. that on this side. Okay, <clears throat> each one of these is going to be making 25 per minute. Yeah, not a lot, to be fair. Um, these are really cramped quarters here. <clears throat> this is going to produce a total of 400 a minute. So yeah, these uh, Mark V belts are more than enough to make that work. Okay, that's going to go around. I'll deal with that shortly. Okay, and then over 
here. Oh, I almost took that up. Almost. So, <clears throat> so these are going to, oh, I do not have very much, one, two, Now that I think about that. <clears throat> that does not help me at all. Hmm. Not sure how to solve this. Yeah, can't put one there, which is why I rotated it. Rotated that one. Ooh, but what I could do, here's what I could do. Let's keep that rotated the same. Okay. Then, that goes there. That goes there this loops around like that and then one two I highly doubt that's gonna stretch all that way nope yep so we need a, a middle for that I think that's three high and then we can get rid of that there. Now they're all tied in together. Uh, come here. Wait, what did I? <laughs> uh, it actually works out. Actually, yeah, that works out. No, I didn't want to. I was. <laughs> I was looking right at the, uh, right at the thing. Why did it look at the thing that's behind the thing? Oh my god. 65. And then you power that. Because you get a belt out there. And then you can just go straight across. I, I knew. In my mind, I knew something like that would work. But I got confused. I got confused. I'm sorry. Um, so over here, same thing. I don't need this one to point that way anymore. You can point just like all of your buddies. And then you point that way. You point that way, and you're happy. No, nope. mark five. One, two. Okay. Whew. Interesting. So these two now can merge together. Um, and I can work on the miscellaneous stuff and things in here. But one thing we are going to need is a way for that. Um, 
Let's put one there just as a marker. Now, the mergers can go over here. There. And there. Because that basically lines up pretty well. Uh, it'll line up a little bit better if I do that. Uh, one more. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Perfect. Well, let's try to eke out a little bit more out of that. And a mark six going up over the top. And that's too low. See, I'm in a hurry, and that's that's what happens. Oh, get in there. So this is one quick wire. This is the other. And then we have a mark six there. Okay. So, let's get the Mark II's. I think I did these ones already, didn't I? Yep. Okay, so that's the quick wire setup. Um, I don't want to bring over the copper sheets yet. I want to get the splitters and stuff in there. And I can do all this and such. Um, in between episodes that's just a lot of busy work that you guys have seen many many times over um, looks like circuits have backed up now quick wire we need quick wire roughly where that empty spot is right there so one thing we could do is take a mark six all the way to the top that and let's see if we can't there's a bunch of machines up there so I want to use this line here Let's get a wall mount. Doesn't quite line up perfect, but that's okay. Now, if possible, One, two, three, four. That's perfect. Like that. to get back up there somehow. Yeah, I got a lot of miscellaneous walls up here. <laughs> uh, it's understandable. Okay, 
this was my wall here. There's there's my potential. Um, I can't use this lower one because that is already earmarked for something. So what I'm going to do is... Can I get a... the lift over there that's that one so one two three four five okay one two three four five six No, <clears throat> I need a splitter. Right there. And I need one right here. So this one's going to be one, two, three, four, five, six as well. That is a delivery of quick wire, which I'm not going to hook up just yet because I don't want the things to back up. I don't want, if I <clears throat> happen to put one of these splitters in wrong or something, I don't want to have to go back and redo all of that. So I will get the belts, get all of the elevated belts. Um, most of these, ooh, 500 per minute. Yeah, those are going to have to be mark fives <clears throat> the copper sheets 125 have to be the mark three so i'm going to need a few materials in order to do this um and again i can do all this stuff off camera so no biggie there all right well that is going to have to do it for this episode and i thank you all for watching and i will see you next time <laughs>